Hey, what's up, Panda fam? Welcome to the fifth episode of the Panda Insider, powered by Insane Labs and hosted by yours truly, Trip J. Before hopping into some news, I first off would like to talk about a couple of new products our sponsors have been coming out with recently. Uh, for instance, Insane Labs has just come out with a new product called I Am God, which is their strongest and best pre-workout that they have come out with yet. They also have released their new mini shaker cup, so be sure to check those out and don't forget to use code PANDA for 20% off at checkout. Moving on to another sponsor, Technisport has also just recently updated their website, pretty much came out with a completely new website. They also have recently released a new black and green chair, which just happens to be Panda's color, so if you're looking to get yourself a Panda color Technisport, you know, like now's the time. They got them out now. You also can use code PANDA at Technisport PNDA for 10% off if you decide it's time to upgrade to a new gaming chair. And last but definitely not least, EGL has also just recently came out with some new uh, flight backpacks, which you can get patches and stuff for here. As you see, we have one. Um, you get these patches, which where you get, they come off, so you can get different patches. Um, eventually, we are planning on getting panda patches, so you can get like different teams and stuff, and just put all the patches, whoever you like, on the front of your backpack. It's pretty cool. Um, I might have to get me one once I start getting team patches and stuff, which are supposed to be coming out anytime. So. Use code PANDA there as well for, uh, I'm not sure of the percentage, but it's also another discount here, 10 or 15, I believe. Well, that's all we have for sponsors today. Um, so moving on, we're gonna move on to the announcements of the video. First off, I'd, I'd like to put out there that the next couple weeks, uh, announcements are gonna be a huge part of these videos. There's gonna be a lot of huge announcements coming out. So make sure you keep an eye on Twitter. Make sure you keep an eye out for the next two video, two or three videos. Um, but for this week, we don't really have all that many announcements, uh, just a couple like minor ones. For this week, our only announcement announcement is that the Panda Sniping Team will actually be making a return. Um, this is the first time it's been mentioned. Look out tomorrow, there's going to be a promo video put out for them. So if you're into sniping or just trying to show some support for Panda, be on the lookout for that video and be on the lookout for the new Panda Sniping Team we'll be picking up. Also, I just want to say thank you to everyone who uh, sent in some pictures to the Panda Gaming Twitter of the Panda logo being at the Meta Threads booth at DreamHack Austin. Um, we saw all of them. We really appreciate it. It's pretty cool um, to see the Panda logo at DreamHack. Um, you'll probably be seeing that more. Wink, wink. Just, uh, yeah. But anyways, moving on, though. It's time to get into the competitive team's talk. First off, our Counter-Strike team has played two more matches in their Continental League uh, since last week's episode, which they won both, so now they are 4-0 in their pool. They had their last match in pools tonight at 9 p.m., so be on the lookout for that. It should be casted. Um, if the Panda Gaming Twitter doesn't retweet it, I will, so just check my Twitter if you're worried about it. And then playoffs for the tournament start on May 4th, so be sure to be on the lookout for the playoffs. I believe all the playoffs will be played within a week, if I looked at the schedule right. Um, so it'll just kind of, like, each day we'll fly through. There'll be a couple matches each day, so we'll probably end up playing uh, three, three or four playoff matches. And there's a couple of good teams that are in other pools that we should run into, so the playoffs could become very interesting. So be sure to be on the lookout for those. Moving on, let's talk a little bit about our FPL Halo team. They had a match last week versus Most Wanted. They ended up being defeated by Most Wanted, sadly, driving to a record of 2-2. Two two. But that's all we have for the competitive section this week. I know it's not much, but like I said, there will be some big stuff coming out soon. So be sure to be on the lookout for a big increase in the length of these videos. Um, there's going to be a lot of announcements coming up. There's going to be a lot of competitive team there's gonna be a lot more competitive teams to cover uh yeah but anyways that's gonna do it for our fifth episode of the panda insider powered by insane labs thanks for stopping by if you enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like subscribe and leave a comment letting me know what kind of games or teams you'd like me to cover in the next week's episode also remember to follow at panda gaming at insane labs with a z at the end and at my and myself at panda trip j on twitter don't forget to share and retweet the video this has been your host trip j see you next tuesday peace out